This is going to be video two uh, of a continuation of a series of three videos of making the, and shooting the .244 bullet out of the Benjamin Marauder. In this video we'll cover uh, crony testing and the accuracy of the .244 bullet. The first step is uh, taking this Marauder back and filling it with air. Gun's got about 2400 PSI in it right now, but I think I better top it off. And here we go. I think I need to rebuild it. There she goes. I guess it was my connection. Air hose connection. Pumping right up now. I don't know if you can see that or not. I, I've featured this in one of my videos. You can uh, thumb through my stuff and, and you'll find it. A video of this machine. Here we go, coming up on 3,000 PSI. That's about 2,900. I'm going to cut it off. All right, let's take it back in the other room and take a few shots with it. Well, here we are at the fun part of the video. Fun for me, anyway. The shooting part. get lined up on my target here it's way down there Well, I'm going to shoot a series of five, and the object will be the bullseye. Here goes number one. A little low. Try another one. Two. Uh, things are really wild. Let me try adjusting the scope. Coming up on shot number three. Bullseye. I'd say I got it. I got it sighted in. <clears throat> Shot four. Bullseye. Got five. And also just above the bullseye. I call it good enough. 
The reason I'm sighting it in <coughs> is because I'm going to shoot it through a crony next. And uh, I've shot this once when I <coughs> tuned it down <coughs> to 500 FPS and I never reset my scope. And the first couple of shots at the crony, I hit the crony. So, not good, not good. Crony next. And I met, might add that those shots are pretty consistent considering it's a 70 to 71 grain bullet shooting out of a Marauder. And the intent with this whole thing is to be able to breach, to break the 200 yard limit and still have kill power, knockdown power. There's a guy doing this, or several people doing it, and they're claiming kill shots at 250 yards from 25 caliber. So that remains to be seen on this, but I think it'll do it. All right, I think it's going to work for me this time. I think I got everything set up. This is a Caldwell Crony, and they have software that work, it work with your smartphone or tablet. Any Android system. Getting a lot of errors off this thing. This called well may not be able to do anything. And I hit the crony. Uh, that's no good. Didn't hurt it, didn't ruin it. It's that stuff on the outside is bulletproof. Whatever it is, a bulletproof plastic. <clears throat> I'm gonna have to reboot it. If I can find the crony. Like I said, I'm going to reboot the crony and see what happens. Attempting shot three. I think I hit the crony again. I hit something. I'm aiming way above it. You know what's going on? Eleven ninety-eight. That's that's pretty moving. 
1198. That's hauling butt. It can't be real. I don't know what's going on. That's reading 451. I know these things are flying faster than that. This gun has been... I just tuned it up. Another error. Four sixty four. Something is wrong. I'm gonna have to retune this gun. The other day it was hitting uh, eight fifty, and now it's hitting four sixty four. I don't think so. Something else is wrong. Something is wrong. Well, that's it for this video, folks. Well, I'll tell you what this. This gun's still sitting at 2300 PSI. I'm going to take a couple of shots with regular pellets in it and see what happens. <laughs> 802. Maybe it's just a weight. Or the drag. Maybe I haven't trimmed them down enough. Okay, this optimum. does that a lot. I don't think I'd buy another call wheel. Just for that reason. And plus it's got to be 15 feet away. Or it won't work at all. I'm going to buy another crony. I'm real happy with this one. You can see it. Twenty nine, twenty four. I don't think so. I will say one thing for it. It's a tough little son of a bitch. We hit it about four times now. <clears throat> well, 
I'm out of ammo. So I'm going to call it good for this video. See you on the next one when I'm making bullets. Well, I don't know, folks. What do you think? It already had those, this one and that one in it. And this is where I just hit it with a, with a 70 grain. Think it's still any good? I don't know. But it didn't look like it went through. But I guess it did. Because you can see where it damaged the battery compartment right here. Plastic coming out of it. The biggest drawback with this with this uh, Caldwell, it's got to be 15, 20 feet away. And getting lined up on the target and not hitting the thing is, uh, it ain't that easy. And I'm a fairly good shot. You just saw me hit three bullseyes in a row. I know I ain't that bad a shot. So, let me know in the comments what you think about the Caldwell ballistic chronograph. Personally, I think it's a piece of junk. Well, it is now anyway. Well, that concludes this video. And I'll, I'm going to buy another crony and, and we'll redo this. Till next time.